everyone welcome back to my channel so today I'm going to be showing you guys how I glow up how to become that girl this is everything I do my skincare body care makeup hair outfit literally anything you can imagine to just make me feel a little bit better you know so right now I do have on some lip gloss and my eyebrows already done because I was like let's just speed up the process a little bit but I did get my hair done yesterday oh thank god these roots are done thank god anyways like comment and subscribe as well as follow me on social media which all my links should be down below and let's get right into it i'm going to be answering some of your questions i posted on my community page and asked you guys to leave me some so i'm just going to be answering all of your randomness so first i'm going to take the derma e vitamin c serum i've been really liking this stuff i'm only going to use a little bit and as you guys know my skin gets so red when i touch it so you already know the deal with that. The first one are, what are your life dream goals? And while I answer that, I'm going to go in with the Plum Plump Hyaluronic Acid Cream. This is from Glow Recipe. So, my dreams in life, oh girl, I got a lot of them. I really pray to be a full-time YouTuber forever, as long as this platform is around. I just love YouTube so, so much. I also want to have my own perfume brand and um, as well as body care brand. I would love even one day to do something in the fashion world, maybe something with like a clothing brand. But ultimately, I would love to have the book that I wrote years ago be turned into a movie. And I've never published the book or anything. I wanted to create a following online before I invested my money into getting it edited and whatnot. It's just, it's my biggest dream in life. It really is. My hair is up and we are going to get right into my body care routine. I'm going to take some Dove Advanced Little Cucumber Spray Deodorant. I'm not a huge, I like the spray, but I don't like the application of it. Like, any new skincare slash makeup favorites at the moment? Girl, I have so many new makeup favorites. It's not even funny. I'm so excited to, though, um, go to the mall and go pick up some of the new body care from Bath & Body Works and Victoria's Secret and whatnot. But for makeup-wise and skincare, oh my gosh, yes, yes, yes. I am going to be doing a current favorites of this month so I could show you guys everything that I have been loving because there are so many that I cannot even name in this video. Okay, what is your current absolute favorite perfume? So you guys know Replica Bubble Bath, hands down, so good. I'm going to be taking some Twinkling Nights. This is the body cream. I love this stuff. I just, oh, I love it. I'm so happy my smell is coming back from COVID. Oh, this next one is what are your starter perfumes? What are some starter perfumes? And I do have videos on my channel that you guys can go check out of, you know, the perfumes I think are great to start off your collection. So definitely go check those out. Um, next one is I want to ask how you and your family are doing. How are you taking care of yourself? Thank you guys so much again just for um, asking. We're hanging in there, you know, with my dad's death. It, no a death is easy at all but we were expecting this for a while if you guys have been following my channel then you would know um you know my dad was terminally ill we had to come to terms when he was alive that he was dying and that there was not a cure for his illness it wasn't like there was a chemo or it wasn't like there was anything that we could put some hope in so um other than you know trial drugs but um yeah so Right now, it's just kind of like starting a new routine again. So this is my first week of creating a new routine. So it's definitely weird, but we're getting used to it. What are some good nighttime perfumes for a woman in her early 20s to wear out with the girls? Now, I do have like date night um, videos, so you guys can go check those out. Um, some really good recommendations, but I would definitely say like Good Girl from Carolina Herrera, Miss Dior um, by Dior. Um, I'm trying to think. Chanel, uh, Coco Mademoiselle, so many. Okay, now I'm just going to take a little bit. I don't really like to put it on my neck much lately, but just on the sides. I don't put it here at all. I used to, but it's alcohol and you just shouldn't. 
So good to hear from you and sorry you're going through such a hard time. My question is, what will you be doing forward after being your dad's primary caregiver? Will you return to college or work? How's your mom and brother handling your passing or your dad's passing, which I just mentioned. But thank you again for asking. Um, for right now, this next summer, um, upcoming summer and spring, I'm just going to do YouTube full time. Put my all into YouTube. I just feel like as of right now that is what my calling is to do that and then in the fall time go back to school so um just to go finish two classes and then see from there i'm not holding a lot of pressure um to myself and next i'm going to do is go in with my perfume this is gold rush from paris hilton okay it says do you like to cook and bake if so what are some of your favorite recipes yes i love love to cook um i'm not a big baker but i love to cook and I love um, to make tofu. I am vegetarian, as many of you know. So I love to cook tofu, vegan, penne vodka. I have so many recipes, you guys, I can, like, share with you for, like, us fellow, like, plant-based people out here. I know it's a hard life, but, oh, you guys, this is so good. So good. Now we're going to hop right into our makeup. So I'm going to be taking, this is the... Super Stay from Maybelline. This is the 30 hour foundation. So I really like this. I hated the old formula. I hated the old formula. But now I really like this. But I do want it to be not as full coverage because this could be definitely full coverage if you build it up. But I would say medium. But I do want it to be more of a lighter coverage. But I added the perfect shade match. This is in sand beige. But I really like to mix it with the True Me or the True Match Lumi Glow Lotion. And I've been on this before everybody be on it, you guys, before everybody. If you could only use one fragrance for the rest of your life, what would it be? Definitely Replica Bubble Bath, for sure. This next one is, are you and Michaela Wagner good friends? Oh my gosh, we are literally best friends. She is my girl for life. I will be calling her as soon as I get off. And she is literally the sweetest human being in the world inside out and she's just ugh, she's a bright light in this world she's amazing so i'm sure you all already follow her but um if you don't go follow her like right now i'm taking my favorite brush in the entire world this is the elf airbrush blender i need to get like a million more of these because they're so good taking the milk makeup contour so i'm just gonna draw it on my nose because i do want it to be more harsh lines What's your favorite dinner and dessert? Definitely penne vodka. And for dessert, I would say like any type of like Italian ice. I love. Next one is your favorite Starbucks drink. Definitely matcha, love, or a cold brew with oat milk. And you also said you are a very kind and lovely person and love from Southern California. Oh, you, mean, you guys mean so much to me. I wish you understood how much your kind comments just right in my day like seriously I, I will never begin to explain how much they truly do next one is what is my zodiac sign and i am a leo and i'm definitely a leo oh my god like all my personality traits for sure leo but um i don't fully believe in all that stuff i do see like obviously similarities but this next one is tell us about your pets so i have a dog named rue he is insane he's literally so hyper and so crazy and i love him so so much but i can't stand him half the time always like bro and then um i have chuckles which is my orange cat you guys probably see and zion which is my black cat who pisses me off i can't tell you how many times i have to edit through a video because i'm yelling at him because he's knocking something over he's doing something wrong as you guys remember probably seeing zylona my old cat in my videos but she ended up passing away sadly and um that was so hard on me oh my god it was so hard on me your videos helped us during some of the toughest times it's only right to be there for you in some type of way i love you so so much that means so much i think your name is anya seriously i love you so much i'm taking the nyx bear with me concealer serum this is superior it is so so good like i cannot even begin to explain next question is do you plan on moving out soon oh girl i would love to i'm planning on probably living here another two years or so just because i mean i rather just save my money and especially because you know you guys know everything that has happened in the past year i need to find like a full direction of my life and be able to actually start making money money you know so 
Um, definitely though, I do plan on moving and someone says, do you plan on living in Jersey or moving out of state? Definitely out of state. I was thinking either California or Florida, so hopefully California though. Tia asked me how I have been doing mentally. By the way, I love you, Tia. You have been such an amazing supporter, literally on my channel for so long. And I just want you to know, I always see your username and I, I really, really appreciate you. But um, yes, I've been doing good. I mean, honestly, like a lot of even people have told me, they're like, Natalie, I don't know how you're handling it so well and you know, this and that, but it's really God. I'm just trying to be my best self and trusting God in this journey. And that's all we could do. This is the Man Eater from Tarte. The best, this is in peachy pink, the best blush. And I have multiple cream blushes and this is so superior. It's new, I love it. I love my Rare Beauty blushes, but I like this more. And that shows a lot, because I love those. This next one is, what do you envision next for your channel? And by the way, Randy, I appreciate the rest of your message, just your positivity and about my dad. And I love you so, so much. Um, but I definitely want to get more into maybe some more like beauty videos, like makeup and whatnot, maybe some fashion, lifestyle. I definitely want to just do vlogs and show you guys my life because I feel like that would be really fun. So yeah, I just want to branch out of it. But I always want to do fragrance, of course. Do you have any um, perfume recommendations for a 28-year-old woman lawyer? Definitely Coco Mademoiselle or Chance, um, but that's by Chanel or Chanel Chance. And it's the pink one for sure, for sure. I'm going to put on a little more blush. I've actually started liking to put um, blush on my nose. I have always hated it, but I'm actually starting to like it day by day. <laughs> Is Amber Romance good? Definitely not my vibe. I know many people love it. I'm just not a fan. I'm going on my first cruise to the Bahamas on May 21st, and I was wondering which scent would be good one would be a good one to bring right now because I have Midsummer Dream in my suitcase. Well, definitely I would say Midsummer Dream, but definitely any coconut fragrances you may have. Um, I would say um, if you have like um, papaya paradise cove, if you have agave papaya sunset, you guys know which one I'm talking about. I don't know why my brain cannot function right now. Um, yeah, any coconutty one I feel like would be really, really good. Okay, now I never set my blush. I'll set my bronzer now. I'm just going to take some wet and wild translucent powder. And I'm going to set everywhere lately. My favorite part of my routine is blush and how I'm going to show you guys how I lighten out my under eye. Now I'm taking my Morphe um, brush. This is the R3 and I'm taking some Laguna bronzer from NARS. The best. And might I add if I'm in a rush, I would just use this on top because it matches perfectly with um this but I am going to put a different blush actually on top of this which I will show you guys which is my favorite combo. Taking some of the Laguna bronzer. I need to buy like a full size when I run out of this because I'm obsessed. This is my favorite blush ever ever. Thank you Madison Beer. This is the Ginger Binge Moscow Mule or Moscow Mule. You guys you're not ready. You are not ready. Amazing, and if you have deep a deep skin tone, this would be the most beautiful thing ever. It works, I feel like, for everyone. Going back and forth, so good. Get get out of here, you guys. Get out of here. So long lasting, so good. Now, before I show you guys how I do my under eyes, this is the order in which I do everything. So let me show you. I'm going to take the NYX Plump Finish. This is so good to just like melt all your makeup together. Now, this girl named, I think her name is Bryn on TikTok. She uses this hack. She doesn't use this powder. She uses a different one. But this is, I'm telling you, follow, use this, use this. This is the Fit Me um, Pressed Powder in Porcelain. If you have darker, darker skin, of course, find your color. Just go for something lighter. Now, while it's still wet, I'm going to press with my beauty blender, tap on the back of my hand to get the excess off. Just watch.
You're kidding. Goodbye, dark circles, and goodbye, texture. It's insane. I cannot believe I have not been doing this. She is a genius for thinking about this, or thinking of this. Usually beforehand, I would always put powder on the bottom and clean it up, but I feel like it looks so good that I don't even need to do that today. Thank God. I'm going simple and neutral. I'm going to be in here and I'm going to take this color right there. It's like this like a brownie, warm toned vibe. And I usually like cool tones, but lately I've been using more um, warm tone, but I don't do like the orangey tones. I hate orangey tones. Take any like cardboard, paper, anything where it has a straight line. Lining up so I can put a little bit on my lower lash too. Then I'm just going to take my brush, lick it because I'm disgusting, and yep, taking the darkest brown in there, and I'm just going to line this and get up a little bit. I'm going to put a little bit in here. What I'm going to do is take a little bit of this pinky shadow right there, small amount. I don't want it to be opaque. And just I want to do a little pinky wash of color. I'm taking my LA Girl brown um, liner. I'm gonna be putting on some of the L'Oreal Telescopic. I'm gonna be doing that and then putting on a little bit of half lashes, which I'm not sure which ones these are at all, or else I would have let you know, but I literally don't know. All right, you guys, I put on my lashes, mascara, and I'm going to show you my combo that I did for my lips today. So I took the Pillow Talk Medium, and I put that as my lip liner, and then I took the um, Buxom White Russian Lip Cream. This isn't the lip gloss. It's a lip cream, so it's glossy, but it's not as, like, burning. But that is the final makeup look. I'm in love. Like, in love is an understatement. I'm obsessed. For my outfit, I'm going to show you guys, I just have on this little J necklace from Forever 21. It is so, so cute. I used the um, J for my dad, or I used, what am I saying? I um, got this just because a J, my dad's name was Jerry, so that is why. This is the fit. This is just this little black crop top from Garage. A little yoga pant moment. I am wearing this little bag from Shein. It's just like this denim with the chains. So it is so, so cute. My black puffer and we are out the door. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want me to do more glow up videos, I would absolutely love to. It was so fun to film. I'm all about like dress up. Even when I was a little kid, I just love dress up. I love like glamming for absolutely no reason other than just, just make myself feel good. Anyways, I love you guys so much. Definitely comment below if you enjoyed this video or any video ideas or if you just want to chat. And I love you guys the absolute most. God bless every single one of you. There are so many blessings in front of you. You just haven't looked hard enough yet. And I will see you guys in my next one.